Yeah, how was it? How was, uh, what was it like being out there for the first time? It was awesome. Uh, first step of becoming a pro. I'm um, excited to be out there with some of my teammates, um, my new teammates, and um, just made me a little bit more hungry. What was the moment like? Bill's gear all in front of you. I'm sure you'd seen it, but to strap it up and, and, and things like that, even without the pads, was that a, a moment that, that you had anticipated, or, or what were the emotions like, even even in a setting like this? <laughs> I mean, football is football. I mean, I was just so excited to be out there because if I was in college, I probably would have been done with spring already. But um, you know, I was super excited to be out there, try to fly around, have fun, and just motivate my teammates, push my teammates, and just keep continue to get better. But it was fun though, super fun. What's the difference between uh, rookie mini camp and, like you said, a spring training camp in college? Um, same thing. It's just all evaluation, all just like I felt like a freshman out there, you know, just new environment. But at the end of the day, football is football. You know, still got to continue to keep getting better. Still got to grind. Still have to earn everything. So, I mean, it kind of felt the same, honestly. Just to, I'm a pro now, you know. What were some of the things that you learned today that you didn't know about? Um, different NFL hashes, numbers are tighter, um, just different terms from college. But football is all the same, honestly. It's just I was just so happy to be out there. <laughs> I was just trying to fly around. What's it like off the field, the meetings, knowing where to be, when to be, learning all that right now as a professional? Yeah, I mean that. I mean that part of it. I mean I enjoy. I could talk football all day. You know. Um, it's awesome, honestly. I'm just trying to embrace it all, trying to learn as much as I can. And, but it's, I mean, it's what I expected, though. It's probably um, a little bit more than college, I would say, just detail-wise. But like I said, football is football at the end of the day. What have you been like getting to know Leslie and Coach Buffett? Awesome. Um, I learned so much my first day, not even on the team with them. And, um, you know, I'm still trying to continue to learn. And, you know, that. Awesome people, like they, they're the same people they, that were uh, off the field as on the field. They coach me the same, talk to me the same. So, you know, that's something I appreciate because, you know, a lot of people, they change on and off the field. They all, they just constantly, uh, consistently the same people. And I appreciate that. Do you feel the pressure as the, the first round pick of this team? Yeah, there's no pressure, <laughs> no pressure. Football, like I said, football is football. I go out there, listen to my coaches make plays and, you know, have fun at the end of the day. Help this team win. That's the most important. Help this team win and stay available. So I'm about to go get treatment right now. What's, what's life kind of, I know it hasn't been that long yet, but what's life kind of been like since you got drafted? Like, is it chaos, a lot of busyness, or is it kind of you got a little time to enjoy it before you got out here again? Um, the night of, I enjoyed it, you know, with my family, but I felt the same, same person, you know, just striving to get better. Um, a little bit different in college. I'm, I'm a lot more healthier now and fresh, but Honestly, I feel the same, just still striving, still trying to learn, <laughs> it's, it's the same. Have you seen the reaction to video of you at the combine interview with the Bills and how Bills fans are so impressed with how prepared you were and how you brought out your notebook? Right. I, I don't know if you've noticed that, but it's been a big thing. Like how, that, does that come a surprise to you? That, or is it just natural? Obviously, you're prepared. Yeah. People are like, wow, look at this kid, how prepared he is in an interview. Like right. That. I mean, that's just something I picked up as a freshman. You know, I wasn't trying to be outside the box or anything like that. That's just something I always did. And, you know, I thought that was something that, um, you know, I was just I always just wanted to show off that I was prepared. Like, I didn't try to not be myself, you know, at the end of the day. You know, I, I try to prepare better than anybody else. But I also try to learn as much as I can. So, I mean, I, that's just me. You know, I, I don't, I'm not in here for likes and follows, you know what I'm saying? I'm here because I love football and I... I just want to help this team win. And, and, and you, you take notes on all the guys you go against, the things that went wrong. I was watching that. Right. Can you save those for now too, in case you face those same receivers, maybe at the NFL level. Oh yeah, I brought. I mean, I brought that notebook with me. Yeah. You know, I'm gonna keep that for the rest of my life. You know, um, if I have to go back to it and, and uh, prepare um, like I did in college, you know, I keep that with me just in just in case. It's just like I don't know, like a like a map almost. Like just, I feel like a lot of people they get better. Or they might get worse as you know as they grow, but I still have my constant notes that you know help me uh, dominate like I want to. Any thoughts on your first regular season NFL game being in LA? Your first game of the NFL season against the defending Super Bowl champ? <laughs> nah, I'm just focused on tomorrow. <laughs> Honestly, you know I got done with practice. I'm just focused on the next meeting. 
I mean that. I mean that'll come. Um, but like I said, I'm just it's football is football. I'm just trying to focus on the next. Well, my next step. Well, I got meeting after this, so I'm trying to focus on that. So. What was it like? Just you know, learning from new teammates like Christian Benford, who's playing out of society. What, what, what uh huh. Was it like? It's awesome. Like I said, I'm trying to motivate. You know, the guys. On, um right next to me and also I'm trying to you know learn from them as well because I'm you know I'm not perfect they're not perfect but we can all learn from each other and um you know he he's a heck of a player um today he did well you know and I mean it's awesome like just being a pro you know what I'm saying other and just seeing everybody how they work and what they do well and things I see that they could that they critique I mean it just we just thriving off each other you know trying to push each other that's all Christian mentioned that you guys were on the same play here. And he said you guys kind of hit it off ever since that moment, huh? Yeah. Yeah. He said that. <laughs> yeah, we did. You know, I was just trying to be myself, you know what I'm saying? Trying to um, be a leader, not trying to step on nobody's toes, you know, not trying to push no buttons. Just, you know, just trying to be myself. Trying to, like I said, trying to pick his brain, trying to trying to see what I what I think helped me just pick off each other. What so. are your early impressions of him as a player? Like I said, he, he did well today, you know, um, really good. Um, I didn't really watch too much film of him, but today he looked great. So, what was it like going to the Sabres game, being in that suite on the video board with Josh and the reaction from the fans? <laughs> I was awesome, man. That's something I never dreamed of before. You know, um, it just honestly just made me a little bit more hungry, or just to see how much they accepted me. And um, I just want to go out there and prove my not even prove to them, but prove it to myself that I can help this team win and, and execute. And, you know, I, I think that just made me a lot more hungry, honestly, and I appreciate that from him. Happy to be a Bill. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Harry. Thank you. Yep.